Hello everybody and Hi. welcome to our very first Paris vlog. We're, um, Paris. we're in Paris, we've just arrived. Um, so we were actually going to start this vlog at the airport um, but it took us two days to actually get to Paris. It's so too, much stress. So much stress. So French air traffic control signal failures. Yes, getting in our Last way. One. <laughs> Um, but we have arrived, we've just checked into the hotel, um, it is half two, it's half two is it? Half two in the afternoon. I think so. Um, yeah, we've just- It's half two. It's half two. So we've just checked in and we're literally just having a little lie down because we're kind of a little bit heady here and it's very, um, very hungry. We could do with like a little 20 minute disco now. Yes. And then it's a gorgeous day, it's like 25 degrees outside so we're going to get changed out of our sweaty airport clothes um, and put on some nice little I was an airport outfits. wanker she was it's probably looking back. backwards but yeah front side <laughs> airport wanker on the plane's front yes but to be fair everyone was stressed for Disney so I don't think anyone knew yeah this. I don't think we stood out no definitely not um, but we are going to be going to the Eiffel Tower today of course it's going to be the first thing that you do when you go to Paris yeah, getting all the touristy stuff out of the way yeah so then we can do more like shopping bits and we're also doing Disney as well and all um, of the food yes a lot of food we I say all of the food on every travel vlog all of the food <gasps> always basically always. if you're going to be watching a travel vlog of ours always expect lots of food because it's going to happen yeah. and we're going to be starting it very Parisian Getting some baguettes, some croissants, some little pastries, oh, pastry, coffees. Oh, I'm just gonna, gonna do the body weight in cheese and pastry, and I'm so excited. Lots of pastries gonna be happening. So yeah. obviously we're gonna be taking you along with everything that we do and showing you our version of Paris. Um, and this is my first time here. This is not Claire's first time. It's it. Ironically, this is this is embarrassing. I have been to Paris about 10 times at least. I've never been to Central Paris. That's crazy. Um, because I used to, for those of you who don't know, I used to um, dance and I've danced in Disneyland Paris quite a few times um, through my old like dance group. Um, so I've danced in Disneyland Paris, so I've been to Disneyland like 10 times. And I've also, um, I used to be a, a fashion buyer and I used to fly to Paris a few times. Um, to um, go to like all the like wholesalers and stuff like that and like a lot of the um, wholesalers are in a place on the outskirts of Paris so I literally used to fly to Paris like every week and I've never been to central Paris I've never seen the Eiffel Tower like how embarrassing is that on for me Crazy. that yeah. is embarrassing for me but I was always working so there was never time yeah so this is actually my first official time in central, central Paris, Paris doing all the touristy stuff even though I've been to the widest city of Paris many a time. Yeah, so we're both very excited to be here. Doing all of the touristy stuff. Yes, and we are here for five days, so there's gonna be plenty of content for you. And like I mentioned, we are going to Disney. We're doing a full day in Disney, but we're gonna be doing that in a separate vlog um, on how to do Disney in a day kind of thing. Um, so stay tuned for that vlog, because that'll be coming after this one. Um, but yeah, right now we're just gonna take a quick power nap, get ourselves ready, and then we'll take you out with us exploring for the day. So, on that note, get ready for the Eiffel Tower. Get ready for the Eiffel Tower. Bye. <laughs> in the area of the Eiffel Tower. Um, what is this area called? I feel like it's just like, I don't know. I don't know what it's called, yeah. but anyway, we've just seen Eiffel Tower and it's absolutely stunning in real life. It's literally like a bus right now above this wall. <laughs> yeah, we've literally just stood by this wall to get some shade so that we can yeah, cool down a little like bit. It's 25 so degrees. Hot. It's so warm today, so hot. Um, and now we are actually gonna go on the, um, carousel at the Eiffel Tower it's like right underneath the Eiffel Tower yeah so we're gonna go do that and then we're gonna go take some pictures for Instagram 
and then we are i think gonna go get more food we just had some food yeah some so like just street vendor little paninis and well, then, actually i won't say little they were huge paninis really, big really paninis. Big paninis. And, yeah and we got some coffees because we were incredibly tired i really appreciate this cup but i don't know why yes yeah, it's actually like a nice massive. little i like it um so yeah we've just done that and like done a little bit of people watching but it's so hot today like it's mm -hmm. i think it's about 25 26 degrees and we are fully in the sun because there's no there really isn't any shades we've literally found like the one little spot so we're very strange right now so yeah. it's this wall and um, we're actually but, stood actually on the as i said the eiffel tower behind us above this wall and we're actually on the river sen yeah uh, with all like the um canal well like the river sen cruises canal the, do I think of my name? The, the river um, send cruise boats going past us. Yeah. It's really beautiful. So we'll show you like some shots of that as yeah. well. Really, really pretty. But yeah, stay tuned while we go for even more food. Yeah, basically. And a carousel ride. Yeah. So let's go. I'm losing the words, yeah. We're both losing the loop well for both. Um, so tired. So tired. It's about, what time is it? Oh, half seven. Half seven. So we've stopped in this place called Hank Pizza, which um, we found on Instagram, but also then when we were watching other people's Paris vlogs on YouTube, so many people recommended it. So obviously we had to come. Um, it's nice and empty, so we can just sit in like a chill Very corner. Chill. Yeah, it's really nice in here. Um, so I'm gonna try and show you my pizza. This isn't gonna <laughs> We'll try. <laughs> no, it's not gonna work. I'm just gonna pick it up and show you. Okay, so. This. I really hope you guys got that. Um, that's my pizza. That's my pizza. And this is Chris. This is my pizza. Amazing. It has Probably. potato on it. A potato totally on a pizza. <laughs> carbs on carbs. It's probably cold now. Yeah. Because as soon as it's the first time I've had Wi Fi all day. So as soon as I got Wi Fi, I was like <laughs> on my phone. Um, but yeah, I don't know what else to say about this place. It's just that, you know. It's really cute. The interior is really lovely. So we'll do some shots and show you guys. But yeah. Um, we'll let you know how the food is, but I think we're thinking we've got loads of um, loads of people on Instagram and YouTube recommending this place, so hopefully it's really good. So it's completely vegan pizza. Um, but yeah, we are super tired, so we are literally going to eat the pizza, eat all of the carbs, yeah. and then we are going to head back to the hotel and then try and find like the supermarket to get some like drinks and stuff to the room, yes. and then we'll catch up with you guys this morning. morning. Yeah, if we can, if, if we can bother picking up the camera leaf there, but we are so tired. But still just go to the supermarket, probably yeah. no point. So, yeah, we'll probably see you guys tomorrow. Yeah. Bye! Bye. Yeah, we are now gonna go shopping. shopping. Uh, first of all, we're gonna head to Avenue Montan, I think it's called. Yes. Um, where we are, oh, I'm just the lamppost. Oh. Casey's walking into lamppost. <laughs> um, yeah, we are heading to Avenue Montan 
and we're basically like all the like the luxury and like designer shops are. So that's so, yeah, like Chanel and Celine and all that stuff. Is. So we're gonna go there first, and then oh wait, cross the road. And then we are gonna go here down the Champs Elysees. Am yes. I saying that right, Champs Elysees? Chom it's got a it's got an M and a P in it, so I literally don't know how to say it. You don't pronounce them. Champs Elysees. Champs Elysees. It's not Champs. <laughs> champs. We're going to Champs. <laughs> so yeah, we're going there, uh, and then we're gonna take some pictures around the Avenue Martin, and the um, we're gonna take some pictures of the Arc de Triomphe. Yeah. And then we are gonna go on a cruise along the River Seine. So that is the plan. That is but the then plan. it all goes to plan, we will uh, remain to be seen. That was but not the original plan though, we've actually flipped our day because we've yeah. spent so long Oh, and up. we're also going to the YSL Museum today. Yes, we can't so forget that. So that's before the River Seine. Yeah. Uh, we were actually meant to do literally everything. We just showed you in backwards order yeah. because the weather was meant to be better. Basically just because the weather has changed and so now yeah. we're going to walk around. So instead, because it might be raining a little bit later on, so instead we of... Do, we've timed the wires on museum to be indoors so that we're inside, during yeah. the rain. Which is perfect. Um, it's another gorgeous day today, it's like 25 yeah. degrees. So Although um, there is a nicer breeze today, was yesterday, I felt like we were like a little bit sweaty and sticky. Yeah, so we've got these blazers on, it's nice. Outfit cool. vibes are really good today. Outfit vibes are really good. Really good outfits today. Yes. And Feeling very Parisian. We'll do proper outfits. Um, we are on the mission to find street litters. Yes. Which we think we'll find on Avenue Montana so that we can take some pics for the gram. Hopefully. So, fingers crossed. Um. So yeah, <laughs> we will pick you guys up in a bit when we are shopping. And show you all our goodies that we will inevitably be buying. I'm sure we will. So, catch you guys in a bit. Bye. Okay, 
so yeah um didn't realize that it was so detailed actually like underneath i don't actually know what all of the writing is to be honest but it's so pretty it's just really pretty basically um it's very very busy today because obviously this is like a popular tourist spot to come through and get pictures um yeah trying to get pictures for the drum was like, a epic. challenge yeah plus we're dealing with a lot of wind today so yeah, double the effort windy. Um, we've just seen a girl actually who had like an Insta boyfriend and she had like he a had like a DSLR with a lens like this long and then he had like a softbox as a well. tripod, tripod with like a, it was like a mini octobox like softbox light and like pure extreme it was it was very we've seen extra. so many people by the way in Paris going like the full on extra mile for the gram like we thought we were bad but like we've seen him we've seen um, another girl whose boyfriend had like DSLR and like flashlight and stuff and then there was a girls on um, near the Eiffel Tower yesterday with all the who balloons. had balloons yeah. like a full-on tree of balloons <laughs> to like take pictures with the Eiffel Tower in the background it was like so much effort it's very really extra. appreciated a lot of, effort a lot of wedding, wedding, yeah, wedding photo shoots going on at the Eiffel Tower there was a lot going on I appreciate Here. all the effort that goes into the gram in Paris so we've just grabbed ourselves some coffee from Starbucks we were craving ice latte and we can't seem to find this anywhere so far is basically Hashtag sponsored, not sponsored by coffee and pastry. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, we just grabbed some of them because we're feeling a little bit like we get a bit tired. We're probably gonna go and look for something to eat now because obviously we're always hungry. Um, so we're gonna try and find some lunch, more pastries. And then what are we doing after? Then we're going to, like we said earlier, we're gonna go to the YSL, YSL Museum, Museum as and well. To a River Sand cruise. Yeah. So that'll be like a nice chill little evening, and then probably an earlierish night tonight because we are doing Disney tomorrow. So remember to check out our Disney vlog that will be coming after this I'm so excited for Disney um, but we're getting a like beautiful child yeah we've seen like Disney stores and things today so we're like so excited for it um, oh and also you would have just seen this cool Batman exhibition that was going on which we just showed you uh, in galleries like I yeah, asked we had no idea that that was we, happening we only like flew in for a second to see the Batman thing because we seen it outside the door um, Sorry, but we were actually going yeah. full shopping um, on Friday, so we've like scoped out now. We've walked along Avenue Montana and walked along the Champs Elysees, and we've scoped out which stores we're going back to. So we've got a game plan on Friday when we do our like shopping. Yes. So as much as we want to shop today, we have held ourselves we've back. Been, we've, we've held been, back. We've been very, very good very, so far. The willpower is like really good. Uh, but I can't get words off. Um, what was gonna say? Casey struggling. She's not happy. Um, potentially might go back for something from like the Batman exhibition just because it was so cool and I feel like I need to come away with something Did you see the Lego figures? The Lego figures, they were insane. And the back signal, so good. Yeah, really appreciate that. Um, so yeah, we're just having a little chill for five minutes and then probably going to head to go get some food. So obviously we'll take you along, show you what we end up getting. And um, yeah, that's a little update for now. Stay tuned. I have a little tips. Little tipsy, I'm not gonna lie. Um, Katie had one glass of wine and it went straight to my head. We hadn't eaten for hours, so tipsy. And then we went in a booth, so not a good combination. And then I still haven't eaten for a long time, so that's what's happening right now. Um, we've just got back to the room. As you've just seen, we've just went on like 
the river cruise, which was an hour long. I um, am here. Claire is here. Here she Hi. is. I'm unpacking. I actually just wanted to show you the excessive amounts of <laughs> these, um, like, biscuits that Claire's just bought. These are life. I discovered them in the airport. They are insane. And I've just found a shop that sold them, and it's the only shop I've seen that sold them. And I want to take them home, so I bought four boxes. Yes, but she's already had, like, one box. Now, these are the ones I bought from the airport. Oh, There's still okay. some left. And this is, like, day two. And there's still some left. But I want to take some home. So, you know, excessive. Um, so we've actually <coughs> bought a lot of goodies Ooh. already. I've just picked up these ones. Um, we've literally just scoured the entire store for any that didn't have any milk in so I could have them. So those are vegan. It was I'm excited to try them. It was successful until we found them. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Um, and believe it or not, me and Claire still haven't had a croissant. Um, I've just bought some. Claire's just bought two croissants, so we, but we still haven't had any. And then also we haven't had any baguettes either. And what else? I like it's a cran. What else have we not I've had? I've had no cheese. Claire's had no cheese. I had wine today, I had a Chardonnay, as I've just mentioned, and I feel it like was... I need to go and get, like, three somewhere. It was very delicious, I must say. Oh, tell them I, I had a baguette. I had a baguette with cream cheese. I had a baguette. You had a panini. <laughs> we had panini. I had a bagel that I cream cheese on oh, this morning, bagel, but I feel yes. like that's more New York than French. So I feel like I need to get, like, a baguette that's got, like, or, like some bread and uh, brie. Yeah. That's me. Yeah. So. And I need, um... Well, actually, I already know where I'm going to get it from. In a few days' time, we're going to be going to this vegan bakery, which has got basically everything French, but the vegan version insane. of it. It does. I'm very excited to go. And I still haven't finished my brownie from last night because it was so rich. And I also have a cookie as well. Well, I'm more excited so, for than anything else. What? Tomorrow, I'm getting Mickey pretzels. Ooh, Mickey pretzels. Mickey waffles. Dole whips. And what all else the Disney do? snacks. All of the popcorn, all of the candy floss. We're gonna be really indulgent tomorrow in the park. Oh, yeah. So we're gonna show you all the snacks that we get um on the other one. They do best hot dog in Disneyland and it's the best hot dog. And I remember I've not had it for years, but I remember having it in Disneyland Paris many a time years ago. And I'm so excited for it. It's in a place called Casey's Corner. Can't wait for that. Claire's been going on about it for two days, maybe three Literally. days. <laughs> so I feel like I need to see this hot dog. Yeah. See if it lives up to the expectation. You can't have it. No, I mean, I need to see it. Oh, it's insane. I need to see it's the hype. It's the best taste in hot dogs. Disneyland is the best hot dogs ever. Just FYI. I wouldn't know, but I'll take you in for it. Um, anyway, yeah, that was just like a little pointless update <laughs> before we just tell you what we Basically, we're doing. Casey's a bit tipped him, picked up the camera for no reason to say hi. <laughs> Basically, yeah, I felt just low, to felt see it, like, <laughs> slightly drunk antics. Um, so yeah, there's not much going on. We're gonna actually go up to the terrace now and take a couple of pictures. Um, some of the outfits that we feel like we're not gonna get a chance to actually wear out. So we're gonna go and do that now to get some, some content. Pics. And then we're gonna see if we can order some food to the room because we're not feeling very sociable. Like we, we wanna, wanna get it in nice tonight. because we're getting up really early tomorrow, obviously, because we need to um, go and get the train to Disneyland yes. first thing in the morning. So we need to be out out the room by like eight o'clock. Yeah, so it's an early night and it's early very start. Early night. Um, and we're doing like showers and hair washing and like a little bit of pampering tonight and just mm. kind of sorting the room out. Chilling. Because we need to check out this hotel on Friday and check into our second hotel. So Which we need to make there. sure that we're super <laughs> organised because tomorrow is like an 11 hour Disney day. It's going to be very Sounds full like on. Sounds like the best day ever. Best 11 day hour ever. Disney day. Um, so we're going to obviously finish with like the fireworks and then head home. So we'll probably get back at like 11 to the hotel. Um, but remember, so. we will not actually see you guys officially you'll see a little bit but if you want to see the full like antics of what we get up to in disneyland we are doing a separate disney vlog so it's not in this vlog we'll show you a little tiny bit but yeah. if you want to see all of it you're gonna to have to watch our uh, next vlog which is our disney vlog yes and film the full day and do that as a separate video so that'd be fun yeah um so yeah that's all we're doing tonight so i feel like we're gonna end day two of the vlog here pick it up tomorrow well, not a little really. Bit. A little bit of tomorrow. You'll see, you'll see mini bits of Disney. Mini bits of Disney. Sneak, Disney sneak peeks and then for we'll, next week's video. After Disney anyway, we're going to be doing a lot of shopping and we've got like the Louvre. I think that's basically the last like few days is basically shopping. The Louvre. The Louvre. Um, and maybe oh, we're going to like the um, Port Alexander and maybe going to the Musée um, d'Orsay. 
yeah, I said that right. Uh, up that and to buy like Notre Dame and stuff like that. So we'll take you there then, and then we're basically shopping for two days yeah. before we get home. So we'll show you all of this. This yeah. is all to come. We've got a couple of days left while we're here, so of course we'll show you as much as we can. Um, so yeah, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Angle. This is a beautiful <laughs> angle of my giant moon face and my boobs. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Okay. Hi guys. So, oh god, I need to fix this. There we are. Oh, hello. Okay, so it is currently day four. Four? Are we on day four? Day four. Oh my god, day four. Yes. Um, so, we haven't vlogged all day. Not picked up the camera once. Literally. Actually, tell a lie, you might have seen like this much footage That's of the insan the <laughs> can't even speak. The inside of the Stella McCartney store. Um we basically just had a really stressful day. We did. We had a lot of, of um, trouble this morning. Yeah. To say the least. So um, like Casey's currency card wouldn't work, so basically she couldn't access any of her money and this was our main shopping day. Then the same thing happened to me with one of my cards stopped working. But it's with the same it was with the same with the company. same company. So it's a Thomas Cook currency card, so we're very angry with Thomas Cook right now. Yeah. Um But also mine that West um Banking wouldn't wait. Oh I'm just banking. we've had a stressful day. Yeah, stressful um, day. Yeah. So which, money issues basically. Yeah. Which That's basically set us back like three hours maybe more yes uh, and we ended up being like really rushed and like late getting to do everything that we wanted to do um also we had to check out that other hotel and check into a new hotel because of i think we did the whole flight it. delay yeah thing situation that whole mess that so that was today that we switched hotels so this is yeah. our new hotel so that's why it looks <laughs> different um, um well, we didn't even, I don't even think we showed you the other hotel, to be honest. Oh, no, we didn't. We didn't give you a room tour. We didn't tour. give you a room tour, but we'll tag it below. It was a nice hotel. It yeah. was nice. If you're it was Paris, small. If you just want it quicker a few days, it's very small. Yeah. Um, But it's really, it looks really nice. Uh, nice little hat, stylish little mini hotel. Good location. Decently priced. It was good. Yeah. It was nice and it looked nice. And we'll pop it down below. Uh, this one probably doesn't look as aesthetically pleasing. It's okay. It's nice. 
um but think... the room's a bit more roomier yeah um and there's like more hanging space stuff like that more space for your bags and stuff the other one was very compact yeah um it was basically like there's your bed in the room and that was it <laughs> so um yeah we basically just popped on here to just let you know that we are still alive that we are <laughs> the worst vloggers in the world worst youtubers on the planet and haven't vlogged all day but, but we yeah. actually um we had a moment before where we sat down for um our dinner which was literally about an hour and a half ago and we were just like we need to stop stressing about things and like trying to cram everything in yeah and we need to stop putting so much pressure on ourselves so yeah vlog and get content and do everything and enjoy the moment more so today we shopped a lot and do you know what we probably would have you guys probably would have liked us to show you more of our shopping but we will show you our purchases like yeah we will do that in like a separate video of like stuff that we bought in paris um so that you can see but basically we went to and other stories and nina bing suzanne and stella mccartney where katie bought a really good purchase. Yes, I got my first style yeah. bag, so I'm excited to I show you. I got some amazing stuff in Anina Bing. It, it was a very su successful day. It was. Um, but we're both really tired, which is why we both look like shit right now. <laughs> and we just don't give a shit what we look like. Like, I've got a giant moon face. My hair is Case well. Case has got a hair crust over a bun. Yeah. Like, I don't care about this angle right now. I'm too <laughs> tired to give a shit, basically. Yeah. We've decided that we need to stop putting pressure on ourselves to give a shit. Like, my boob is so far up my face. I look like I've got no neck and I'm like this. But you know what? That's okay. Because yeah. real life. Um, but our next two days, we ends up having a really successful shopping day. Even though we didn't pick up the camera. So because we managed to cram so much in and we're so rushed with our like short amount of time after being held back we realized that the next two days which are our last two days are going to be quite spaced out and more chilled so we'll have more time to vlog do more like touristy sightseeing is sightseeing and stuff and basically get the camera out more and yeah it's going to be a lot less pressurized a lot more relaxed for us and hopefully a lot more fun for you guys to say god that is not attractive when i put my hair back <laughs> jesus <laughs> This is um, not a good angle for anyone, don't do this. But yeah, we we do still have plenty of stuff to show you guys and like Claire said, a lot of like touristy things as well. Um so we're gonna, we're gonna bring you along for all of that because we're not gonna be stressing out and we've got a lot of good food the next two days as well. Yeah. We're gonna eat a lot more. Yes. We, we feel like we up, haven't eat we like, make up as much as we time. normally do. We've been doing a lot of grab and go, so our next two days we're gonna like eat all of the food. Yeah. Um, I haven't had nearly enough pastries. I'm in Paris and I've had like one pastry and I'm not happy about it. One bit. I don't think I've had any. No. I've had a couple of cakes. We're going to a patisserie tomorrow. Yeah, we are. Is that tomorrow or no, Sunday? No, no, that's Sunday. Sunday we're going to a patisserie. Yeah. But um, yeah, I need to eat more pastries and more just more cakes in general and more, of everything. more bread more cheese yes i just Katie wants stunning, more wine i just had a stunning bowl of pasta i'm very happy about it yeah. i didn't show you guys because it was so basic but like we were so starving we literally yeah. our food got put in front of us and we just inha it. Like, inhaled it yeah and then decided to come back to the room and just chill and we've got like lots of like snacks we have like some Quinoa puffs. Quinoa puffs. We have Disney popcorn. We have lots of like biscuits and all I'll the good stuff. Uh, yeah, so we've got loads and loads of snacks. So we're just going to chill in the room, get showers, wash our hair, and have like an early night. It's about half nine. Yeah. So yeah, we're just going to have a chilled night and prepare for the next two days. Um, we are tomorrow. Um, we're going to like walk along this, uh, the River Seine. Seine? Seine? whatever Sam. it's called yeah uh, we're gonna walk along the riverfront we're gonna go um we're actually gonna go try and go up the eiffel tower if we can yeah and see the view so that'll be the, nice we're doing the louvre first thing in the morning as the well. louvre's first thing tomorrow yeah so we'll see if we can take you guys inside that and show you around a little bit and hopefully give you i'm not sure if you can i've never seen anyone vlog inside oh really i've never seen it so well, we'll i don't vlog know outside, at least. we'll definitely vlog outside but we'll yeah. see if they let us vlog inside yeah, and then we're going to show Shh, you... Might show you the Mona Lisa. We'll show you the Eiffel Tower probably twice tomorrow. Once up it and also once in the evening when it's all like lit up and sparkly. Yes, we're going to see the sparkly lights tomorrow. Yes. We actually haven't seen it yet. We've been here three days. This is I day know. four and we still haven't seen it. This is crazy. So yeah, we need to definitely go and see the sparkly lights. Yes, so that is what we're doing tonight. And there is still lots of content to come. So 
enjoy enjoy the next two days of what we're about to show you we and are gonna um, enjoy eating all of the snacks and just basically vegging out in the room and chilling yes because it's much needed so stay tuned for tomorrow guys <laughs> trying to find me like um okay so we are hi oh here's Claire I was taking pictures so <laughs> um we're at the Louvre right now it's about it's just gone half eight in the morning yeah um the queue is quite big I'm not gonna lie quite large but we're basically gonna take some quick pictures get some tickets and then head on inside so obviously we'll see the Mona Lisa we don't know if we can film inside but we'll take you in with us anyway and see what we can get for you yeah um, but it might just be that you see the outside of it and then that'll be the last thing that you see so stay tuned um but yeah we kind of need to get a move on and get these tickets yeah it's just starting to get really busy we need really to get busy. some pics as quick as we can before it gets crazy busy because it is saturday morning so it's yes. gonna get like crazy busy gonna go and get our um get our culture on and go and see so go and see the mona lisa see some antiques yeah. so Let's go with us. There's Mona right there. Mona just chilling. Hi everyone, so here's Mona. Don't know if you can see that. This is extreme, it's like pure aggressive. Casey's over there trying to get a picture. There she is, behind me, over there. It's proper extreme. There's Mona. <laughs> She's back there. Hi. We did see her. People are like extreme trying to get a picture. It's proper aggressive. They're like, get a picture now, move. This is actually hilarious. It's so funny. Like, I'm crying. She's bigger than we thought she'd be. Kate, yeah, Kate thought, thought she was going to be like A4. She's not equal. She's bigger. She's bigger. But yeah, there's Mona. So, uh, we'll see you outside. So we've just seen like the lights sparkle for the first time. We're gonna go down now and try and get some pictures of the next like when it sparkles, it sparkles every hour on the hour for five minutes. So we're gonna try and get down for the next one. Uh, but yeah, we just thought we'd show you guys the view. Up here, Katie's really suffering. So we need to get right. She can't speak. She's suffering. She's freezing. So we really need to get like down. So we just wanted to show you guys this amazing, incredible view of Paris from up here. We just showed you some of the uh, other views and up there. So yeah, we just wanted to bring you guys along, but it's definitely worth a visit when you guys come to Paris. Although we do recommend doing it earlier in the day when it's not freezing cold. Yes, or oh, if you're going to do it in the night. Bring a big coat. <laughs> big coat. Uh, but yeah, we just wanted to show you guys. Uh, we're going to head out tonight and we'll catch up with you guys tomorrow.
Okay, hi guys. Hi, again. Right, we are on our day six last day yeah. of Paris. We're um, going home in a couple of hours. Yeah, we're going home. We're gonna, we're just, we're just up for something to eat. Um, we both felt like we just wanted to like have pasta or pizza. That's what we stopped for. Yeah, we felt um, it's just like random little Italians down the side, one of the side streets near um, Galleries Lafayette and the H&M flagship in Sephora. Yeah. Literally just down one of the side streets. We looked up at it. It's called the Cordial Cafe. Yes, yeah. and it was on our list of places. But we just felt like we needed stop. to pick a place and sit down, yeah. basically. Um, so, I busy, so that's always a good sign. Yeah, and I've just got a little spread down. Uh, the waiters just see a point. Oh. <laughs> Um, Hi. Yes. Yeah. So, thank you. We haven't spoken to you all day because um, <laughs> we just, we had one of those mornings basically, and yeah. it was just a little bit hectic. We didn't really want to pick up the camera in a bad mood, so we had a lot of stress. So. Uh, we had a lot of trouble. Um, just I don't want to go into it too much because I feel like this whole vlog will just end up being us not moaning about stuff. So, yeah. I don't want that because we had had fun. We had a fun trip. Yeah. But. Just bottom line, don't ever, ever, ever use the Thomas Thomas Cook cash passport card, Mastercard. We've used it on two trips now, and we've had nothing but trouble and just ridiculous things worked out. Yeah. Thomas Cook cash passport currency card. If you want to put your money on it? Don't do it. Yeah. It's not worth it. Find another company. Read the reviews because it was horrendous. Yeah. So don't do it. That, Anyway, our stress for morning was down to that. Yeah. End of story, it's all sorted now, we're happy. Yeah, so we're just going to get some food in our bellies. We thought we had back to the hotel. Um, we did a bit of shopping this morning. A little bit of shopping. And there was a couple of things that we didn't manage to do on the trip, but it's one thing where we're not too fussed about them yeah. because Paris is like an hour away yeah. and we can come back whenever we please. We can come for like one night and just do two days. Like, yeah. It's very doable. Exactly. It's not that far, we can come back again. It's not like the other side of the world, we have to come Britain in. Yeah. Um, but we just had a nice chill day. We basically just like bundled around, ate some breakfast at Season Paris, which we highly recommended, and they're really popular on Instagram. Mm. We're not, we're not fully convinced. This on the is height. a Paris equivalent. Paris is a new. Yeah, yeah, I can't speak. I need food. So this is the Paris equivalent of when we were in New York and went to. Oh, that was a pigeon. <laughs> <laughs> when we went to Jack's White Freezer, it was so hyped and we were just like, yeah. mm. and then Elan Cafe in Elan London. Cafe in London. Exactly so place. hyped, food was shit, service was shopping. Season Paris, seriously? Yeah. yeah, the food was nice. The food was nice. The, place the service was, was like, yeah. It was dirty. Yeah. Um, it needs to clean. Now Don't I've been to Serendipity 3 in New York, which again, if you know, it's been in like so many movies and things, and people tell you to go to it, and it's like a two hour wait for a table. Um, and it was so dirty. So this was a similar thing where similar. It, it wasn't like disgusting, it was just like it needs it a good, needs good scrub. Yeah. Like the toilet's being clean, the toilet was broken, there was one toilet for the whole place, and it was broken, there was no toilet seat, and the flush was like a just into the leaf, and yeah. flushing water. And the, the floor was filthy. The there was like sauce to, on the wall. There was mustard on the wall next the wall. to me, and it was just so dried up and crusty, and I couldn't even look at it. Like, so was the last time you ever cleaned that. Yeah. Um, the service, I don't want to say the service is bad because I think they were doing what they can, they, yeah. but they just all seem to be running around like headless chickens. Yeah. Just all young people and nobody seemed to know who was safe was what. We were safe by about seven different people, yeah. but there was not enough staff to cope with the amount of people that they had and no one was dealing with their own things. They were all doing a million different jobs at the same time. So I think that sounds like poor management and staffing issues. Yeah. But yeah, it was just all of it. It was very hectic. It and was. a bit of And that's not what you want when you're yeah, like, having your first you meal of the day. Relax dive and I didn't get that plus you have to queue outside for ages. Yeah, and I was freezing and hungry and it wasn't. We got, we got to a level of hungry. Yeah, we did. It was yeah. So I feel like it was just known again. Once we've done is known. Paris is good. But yeah. Yeah, we've we had, had a we have had a few moments on this trip so we, we don't want to think that we're just moaning bitches and we complain about everything. Because we have had a fun time and there's loads of stuff that's been like amazing, like going up the tower. Amazing. As long as you wear the coat and the queue. <laughs> yes. it's cold. Um, that was amazing, the views were insane. Uh, seeing the sparkling lights on the Earth Tower, amazing. Yeah. Canal views, amazing. Really recommend doing that, uh, especially in the warm weather, it's lovely. 
Um, it's been like, it's been like really good. Cool. Like we went on the carousel, loved that. Yeah, that was actually so much fun. That, that was so much fun. That was a fun day. Uh, and just like um, exploring and all that stuff. Like why the museum was good. I think at the end of the day, if, if we didn't have those like couple of card issues and things, it would have just been a lot more of a smoother trip. Yeah. So I think that was what. Yeah, a lot of our main issues has been like. Out of our control. Out of our control, and, yeah. So like the flight being cancelled and I'm coming two days later, I haven't had the second hotel chain and hotels in the middle, yeah. all the issues with the currency cards. It set us back and made us, we've spent a lot of our trip on the phone yeah, dealing with fix stuff things. like that and trying to fix things and being like unable to access our money yeah. for like hours at a time. So, and I've had issues with stressful. my phone service as well, um, yeah. on with Virgin Mobile. And I'm thinking the next time when it's time for me to renew every contract that I won't go with them again because I've had. It's just been impossible and like even just getting me getting Wi-Fi has been a bit of an issue and I've been literally using the first hotspot most yeah. of the time so luckily she's got that otherwise I wouldn't have even been able to send a text 60 gig. Yeah. 60 gig on both of them. Like just, so just sending, a, Roman. sending a text message has been difficult so yeah it's been a lot of technology bit. based stuff that's yeah. like set us back and meant that we spent hours of our trip sitting doing not on, and on the phone yeah. complaining and it's sort of put like a damper on like a little part of it yeah. but the bad thing really is we just don't want to moan on the vlog and act like we're just moaning bitch all the time well, we, we just want like to keep it real people yeah we want to tell you these things so that you know yeah don't use this card it's awful don't go to this place and waste your money yeah because it's dirty and it's not worth the hype so yeah we may be moaning bitches but at least we keep it real and we tell you yeah. what not to waste your money on yeah. and what's worth going to. So we hope you like this kind of stuff. Um, this is probably the last thing that we're going to do. Yeah, I think so. So we hope you've enjoyed the vlog. We'll end it here. Yeah, let's end it here. We're going to eat our pasta and then just head Actually, back to the hotel. Actually, so we'll show you our pasta we'll and then the pasta. we'll end it. Yeah. We'll show you the pasta and then you may get some sneaky peeks of uh, Katie's dancing. Oh, maybe. We'll see. Maybe. Katie pissed dancing last night. It was probably yeah. shitty phone footage, but trust me, worth the watch. Uh, and make sure that you tune in to our uh, next vlog, which is our Disney and Paris vlog. We yeah. did today in Disney. So you will have seen some clips of the little cool Disney vlog on the way and then the next video that we're going to do is we're going to show you Evan Rain Paul in Paris. So, so, so Paris Paul is coming. lots of amazing like Anina Bing, Stella McCartney, Zach, yeah, loads. A so, lot of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. So yeah. we'll see you next time. Hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you soon. Bye. Bye. Angle. This is a beautiful angle. And then we went in a booth. She's not equal. She's bigger. <laughs> this is Katie off one large rose. Repping the quinoa chips. <laughs> She's dancing to the Big Bang Theory in French. <laughs> this is what I have to deal with people. <laughs> but those are some moves. The best I've got. Shake what you've got.